Welcome to Hypercar Global, the channel where we take a look at electric vehicles, Tesla and of course Elon Musk. Today we take a look at Tesla's Tesla's new type of motor, how Tesla will help the community and finally look at the Model S Plaid setting records. Without any hesitation let's get into the video. More details on Tesla's innovative carbon-wrapped motor. Tesla is always coming up with innovative solutions to solve problems large or small, and one such example was revealed at the Model S Plaid delivery event last week. Elon Musk spoke about this achievement briefly during the presentation. Something we're really proud of is the new carbon-sleeved rotors for the motor, he said. This is the first time that there's, to the best of our knowledge, been a production electric motor that had a carbon overwrap rotor, he added. Elon also pointed out that this was pretty hard to do since carbon and copper have different rates of thermal expansion, it needs to be wound at extremely high tension in order to achieve a carbon overwrap rotor. To achieve this goal, Elon said that the team had to design the machine that makes the rotor. This was a first because no such machine ever existed before. However, this gives Tesla another ability, making the electromagnetic field super efficient while having a tight gap even at extremely high revolutions per minute, RPM. Alex, at iTorville, on Twitter shared a thought that Elon replied to with some more details about this new feature. Elon pointed out that the Plaid's carbon-wrapped motor is the most advanced motor on the planet outside of a lab and that they have a few ideas for increasing torque and max RPM even further for the new Roadster. Elon also gave some more details about how the fiber is wound. It's wound over the rotor at a high tension load. The machine that wound it was created by Tesla Automation. Tesla Automation is in Germany and was established in 1983 as Groman Engineering. It became Tesla Automation in 2016 and is headquartered in Prüm, Germany. The carbon sleeve needs to put the copper rotor in compression or it would loosen at low temperatures. This is due to differential thermal expansion. The main benefit of the new motor is that the carbon sleeve rotor creates a stronger electromagnetic field than a rotor that is held together by metal. Elon pointed out that these are usually made with high strength steel. Another advantage is that the rotor can go to higher RPM, as the carbon sleeve prevents the copper rotor from expanding due to radical acceleration. The most advanced motor in the world leads to the fastest cars ever I think we've really taken it to a whole new level with Plaid. Elon Musk When Tesla designed the new carbon-wrapped motors, it created a land rocket, the quickest production car on the planet. It can reach a speed of 60 miles per hour in just 1.99 seconds, and I can tell you firsthand that it's intense yet fun. With this new machine and those Tesla secrets, it's clear that Tesla plans to break its own records. The Tesla Model S Plaid's record acceleration will eventually be broken, and the probability of that record being broken by another Tesla vehicle, a HEM, Roadster 2.0, is very, very high. Tesla and Austin Community College launch new Tesla Start Manufacturing Program. Austin Community College ACC and Tesla have launched a new 14-week intensive training program that will give students hands-on learning experiences for a manufacturing career at Tesla. The new Tesla Start Manufacturing Program at ACC is the first of its kind in the nation. Through a combination of in-class theory, hands-on labs, and the flexibility of self-paced study, students can gain technical knowledge while earning certifications along with detailed knowledge about Tesla and its products and services. This will help students prepare for a career at Tesla. Students who participate in the study are also paid employees at Tesla while completing the program, and once they've completed it, they are eligible for a full-time position at Tesla. Some of the hands-on experiences that students will get to learn are robotics and control systems to design, build, and maintain advanced machines. Students will work in specialized labs located at ACC's Riverside campus. For students who want to take the program but can't afford tuition, financial support is available, up to full coverage. ACC list of the start manufacturing program requirements, which are high school diploma or equivalent, mechanical aptitude, ability to take apart machines, equipment, or devices to remove and replace defective parts, technical ability, ability to check blueprints, repair manuals, or parts catalogs as necessary, detail-oriented, strong organizational and follow-up skills, problem-solving ability, ability to think outside the box to solve new problems. Physical ability, ability to use common tools such as hammers, hoists, saws, drills, and wrenches. Ability to maintain focus while working individually. Ability to work quickly under pressure. Versatility, ability to thrive in an ever-changing and evolving environment. Tesla continues to keep its promise to the Del Valle community. 
This newest development with ACC is just another way Tesla is keeping its promise to the Del Valle community, Austin, and Texas. Last month, Tesla hired Del Valle ISD students to begin working at Giga Texas and there was a special event commemorating this. Austin Tesla Club Vice President Anwar Bekamanbeyev was there and he pointed out that Tesla kept its promise to be an active part of the local community, whereas Facebook and Google failed. The failure of the latter two companies made many fearful that Tesla would also fail at this. However, Tesla has been very active in the community and the local Tesla Owners Club plans to step up and help support both Tesla and their own community. When Tesla first came into the community here, there was a lot of pushback. People were saying that Tesla is going to come in like Google and Facebook and all these other tech companies and promise the world but not really have an impact on the local community, Anu Arbeck told me. Tesla's getting super involved with the community before they've even finished the factory. They are already offering local jobs. Even the food that was at the event was made by Del Valle High School students. They have a catering program at the high school. They made the cake for the celebration. So, talk about hiring and sourcing locally. Tesla Model S Plaid breaks all the records in first independent test, but 0 to 60 miles per hour has a caveat. Tesla Model S Plaid has broken several production car records in its first independent tests with Motor Trend, but the insane 0 to 60 miles per hour in less than 2 seconds needs an asterisk next to it. When Tesla unveiled the new Model S Plaid, the automaker announced that it's going to break the record for quickest production car with a 0 to 60 miles per hour in 1.99 seconds and quarter mile in 9.2 seconds. The automaker had Motor Trend perform the first independent tests of the new Model S Plaid. Before they could do that, though, Tesla had them test the new performance sedan on a drag strip with a VHT prep surface, basically sticky asphalt, at the Famoso Raceway near Bakersfield, California. On that surface, the new Model S Plaid was able to achieve an even faster than advertised 1.98 seconds 0 to 60 miles per hour acceleration and a quarter mile in 9.25 seconds at 152.6 miles per hour using its drag strip launch mode, which takes a little while to activate and get into its cheetah stance. That's with the first foot of rollout subtracted, which is how Motor Trend tests all vehicles. But the 0 to 60 miles per hour acceleration in less than 2 seconds comes with the caveat that it needs to be achieved on a VHT prep surface at a drag strip. Tesla reportedly told Motor Trend that they believe most customers will run the Model S Plaid at drag strips, but many drag strips will require a bunch of additional safety measures before a vehicle as fast as the new Model S Plaid can race, which could discourage many owners. But the good news is that it doesn't actually make a massive difference when testing on an unprepared surface. Motor Trend's independent tests showed a 0 to 60 miles per hour acceleration in just 2.07 seconds and a quarter mile run in 9.34 seconds at 152.2 miles per hour. Those stats are now the new records for production vehicles, including beating the quarter mile of the Ferrari La. Ferrari. The only vehicle that could potentially take away the throne from Tesla is Rimax New Navira, but it depends on your definition of a production car since it's a limited production vehicle that starts at $2 million. The Model S Plaid starts at $130,000 and Tesla is likely going to make more of them in a few days than the number of Navira hypercars Rimac will make over several years. And you know what? The Navira also happens to be all electric, so if one thing is clear, the highest performance vehicles in the world are now all electric, and the scary thing is that they are still getting better. Let me know your opinion on Tesla being a key part of the community and helping people get the skill set to work at Tesla. What do you think of the new motor? If you enjoyed the video please leave a like and if you are new to the channel, why not subscribe? This way you support the channel, turning on bell notifications let you know when we upload so you never miss a video.